I hope you get this message. My name is Cassandra Williams. I'm a psychic consultant for a paranormal TV show called Ghost Patrol. We're filming an episode here in the deserted town of Bitterford, Maine, and I need your unique expertise. There's something terribly wrong here. I can feel it. Uh, no, we were just leaving, and no, I don't give out autographs, so if you'll excuse me. Has anyone seen my lip balm? You don't know who I am, do you? Jack Talon, host of Ghost Patrol. Rated number three in reality TV ghost hunting shows by the readers of the Paranormal Weekly blog. Come at me, ghosts! Nothing? Ah, you're that detective Cassandra called. No wonder you haven't heard of me. You're obviously too busy solving your little crimes to watch quality television. Well, knock yourself out poking around this crappy town. Ghost Patrol is off duty. Oh. Penny Clark reporting to you live here from our studios at KHAD, Portland, Maine. Boy, it looks like real pea soup fog out there today, folks. So be careful out there on those roads. This has also caused huge problems for air traffic. <laughs> All flights have been grounded until further notice. But they come.
Must be the master detective. Thank God you got my message. I didn't know who else to call. And that ghost patrol is more interested in ratings than solving this mystery. I'm Cassandra, by the way, the one who left you the message. Oh, we have our work cut out for us, so I think we should start right away. Take these drawings I've made and this two way radio so we can communicate while you're investigating. I'll give you the directions to the Shadow Lake Penitentiary and explain more as we go on. Good luck, detective. Spirits have been communicating to me through a technique we psychics call auto-drawing. With their guidance, I've made the drawings I gave you, representing actual locations in town. All you need to do is place each one on the spot where its spiritual imprint is strongest, and then bring them all back to me. Let's start here, at the old prison. Place the first drawing on the matching window, and charge it with psychic energy. Nice job, detective. Sadly, that is the only drawing I recognize. But I'm sure you'll find the rest somewhere in the prison. battery in the EVP recorder is fully charged and the sensitivity is set to high. I'm hiding the key to the prison underneath the stone ball at the base of the entryway steps. Hey, did you guys just hear something? Shh, listen.
This place is overflowing with supernatural power. If you could find these objects infused with the psychic energy of lingering spirits, I may be able to get a clearer picture. Detective, I'm getting a reading from the objects that you have found. There was a prisoner here by the name of Jamie. Jamie Monahan. Maybe you can find some more information about him in the records room. Sometimes you will need to recreate the scene from the drawing before placing it. Find these missing items and place them on the shelf just the way they appeared in 1973.
You're good, detective. Now bring the altered drawings back to me and I'll do a psychic reading on them. Welcome back, detective. We're already making headway. Place the drawings on the table here. Let's see what vision of the town's past these drawings reveal. <laughs> 